Hello Internet people, my name is Robert and in this video I'll show you how to add WhatsApp chat to a WordPress website. So you can have a WhatsApp live chat on your site in just a few minutes. And you can start chatting to your potential customers and it's totally free. The cool thing is that if you have a bigger team, the premium version of this plugin enables you to include multiple agents in the same chat box. So let's get the party started. See you at the party Richter! Sweat punch. First, let's install a plugin that will add a WhatsApp quick to chat right into your website. Let's get started by going to your WordPress dashboard. All right, I'm here in my WordPress dashboard and let's go to plugins and add new. And here just type in WhatsApp chat. And you'll get a few options. In our case, we're gonna install this WP social chat by quad layers. Just click on install now. And don't forget to activate it when you're done. Next, let's change a few settings in the plugin so that it will work properly. Now, if everything went well, here on the left in the menu, almost at the bottom, you should have WP Social Chat. Uh, so let's go in there, just click on this one. And this is where you have your whole dashboard to this plugin. So first we need to make sure it's enabled. Go to Display tab. Loading. And here, just choose your target where you want to show and make sure you have that all devices, that this will show up on all devices. And here, just add all. And also, if you want categories and tags, you can add all. I'm just going to add it like this. Save it. And one more thing we need to do is go to button. And here, you need to add a phone number that actually works. And this is the phone number that the agent will be using and you need to add it with the country code, but without the plus. So in my case, I live in Netherlands, so I'm gonna put the three one, like this, and then just scroll down here at the bottom and click on save. To test this plugin properly, you will need to have a second WhatsApp account. And you can just use your friend's uh, mobile phone or something uh, to get it done. And now if you go to your website, and let's pretend I am a user. I'm a user that I come here and I can see here at the bottom, there's a WhatsApp icon. If I, if I click on it and I'll see sexy Bill hugging a computer. you will ask me to log into the WhatsApp web. You can achieve this easily just by going to your WhatsApp on your phone, tapping on settings and then tapping on WhatsApp web slash desktop. Tap on that. And then at the bottom, there's a scan QR code. On Android, this might look a little bit different. And then when you scan the QR code, you'll be able to log in. And you can start uh, chatting with the agent. Same thing on the phone. If you go to your website and here on the bottom right corner, you have the WhatsApp icon. If you tap on it, it'll take you to the WhatsApp chat and you can start uh, chatting with the agent. Hey, if you liked the video so far, consider hitting the like button. That will help me a lot with the YouTube algorithm. Sling! Like no, God! Okay, so we have now a working WhatsApp chat, but it doesn't look that good right now. So let me show you all the available settings in the free version. So let's start with the button tab first. You can see that the first drop down is to select if you want WhatsApp to show up as a bubble or a button. You can see what I mean here on the right. This is the difference. Then the next option is to select if you want the rounded borders. Again, you can see the difference on the right. These are kind of similar. Then we have the position of the icon. So you can put it either at the bottom of the page or in the middle. I prefer in the bottom left or right, just so it's not interfering with users experience if you have the premium theme you could add an icon you can update the text that appears next to the icon you can change this to anything but try to keep it kind of short then there's the phone but we already updated that one then you have this message this one i find it a bit strange this is basically a pre-written message for the visitor and not for the agent so for me this doesn't make any sense, so I'll just delete it. You've just been erased. And don't forget to save your changes. Now, 
let's go to the box tab now you can enable the box feature so if you do enable it when visitors click on the whatsapp icon they will see something like this so you can adjust that chat box with some logo and text and this is where you could also display multiple agents for example one of one for customer support and one for billing this is where you also adjust the text here at the top and also at the bottom and you can add icons and stuff if you like this feature then don't forget to save it next let's head to the contacts tab there are some other features i didn't show you yet just click on the edit button you can obviously change the name robert tips with punch phone number just enter the one you need you can set here the visibility for each agent so you could have different agents for different parts of the site like a sales guy on the price page and maybe a customer service agent on the faq section arnie how do you deal with agents crush your enemies see them driven before you and they hear a lamentation of their women you can set them here easily just add for example blog or whatever you need if you did any changes then save this and click on close the display tab we can skip and then let's dive into the colors tab this is where you can change the color of the icon and the box around it now for some reason by default this is set to black but if you want to have the proper whatsapp green so the brand of whatsapp then just copy this color code into the color picker you just type in the same color code here and then save the changes and now if you go to your site and you refresh the page you will see that your whatsapp chat icon is the right kind of green if you want to customize the chat box even further or have a multiple agents available in the chat or you just want to have a better automatic messages then you need to buy the premium plugin it costs 20 dollars for one website but it's a one-time fee so it's not too bad and if you use the link in the description you will get a 20 percent discount on your purchase so just scroll down into the description of this video and click on the first link it'll open up a new window where you can actually see all the features of the premium plugin and if you scroll down you'll see you can get the personal license which is for one site and it's a one-time payment of twenty dollars and if you add this to your cart on this page you'll be able to add a coupon code from here if you use this coupon code you're gonna get 20 percent off of your purchase since you're clearly investing in your website make sure it's super fast to load i have a video right here that will show you how to improve your website load speed with just a few plugins or maybe you are looking for free high quality images to use on your website i have a few sites that i use and i talk about that a bit more in detail just in this video Oops.